Okay, everybody, I have a 2006 Toyota Corolla. A uh, customer complained that his AC worked intermittently. Sometimes it come on, sometimes it don't come on. So I want to make a quick video for you guys. <clears throat> this is what I find. Um, this is the uh, relay right here, the uh, blow motor relay. Uh, this right here was rusted from top to bottom. And I'm going to show you where it's at. So let's come here on the passenger side of the vehicle. I took the glove box off so I can see it. And is this is the relay box right here. You got two relays and then one big relay. The one big relay is the one that goes to the blower motor. And it's, uh, let me put the light down for a second. And it's mounted on top, up, right here on top. If you can see this bar, right here. I'm sorry, I can't really show you because it's real tight. But it's mounted right here, and at the bottom you can see the yellow connector. That's for the your airbag sensor, and. It's got three 10 millimeter bolts. The two, the bottom, you can get to it, but then there's another one on top. Uh, you have to get a, a wrench or maybe a little, you know, small uh, quarter inch socket, but I'm not sure if you can get to it with that. But I use my ratchet wrench to get to it and I loosen the bolt on top and I pull it down. Once I pull it down, you can access the relay. So the big relay is the one that gone uh, that was bad because of it was rusted, and this is how you can tell because when the customer turn on the button uh, for the blower motor, nothing come on. the The light on this uh, AC button when it's pushed in to come on it doesn't even light up but this one for the circ air circulation lights up but this one doesn't light up because <clears throat> this doesn't turn on so when this when you turn this on it doesn't come on so it will not light this up and I thought maybe this this controller was bad so I got another controller from the junkyard but it's still the same problem and after I did all the research and I find uh, that they were saying that there was another, there's a blow motor relay underneath the, uh, the dry, uh, passenger side uh, by the glove box. And I'm looking, I'm looking and you can't really see it. You have to reach your hand up in here. And when I reach my hand up in there, I feel three relays. So like I said, remove those three uh, bolts and you will find this big relay right here. It was rusted. And when I put it back in, after I cleaned it, I put it back in and I turn it on. The uh, blow motor and the AC came on and this button light up. So if you try to troubleshoot your AC system and when you turn this on, nothing come on and this does not light, light up. It's gonna be your blow motor relay because your blow motor had to come on before this light up if this light up when your blow motor uh, does not come on it's either gonna be your res resistor or your your uh, blow motor itself so that's another video that you can uh, look up but this is what I find when you turn the switch on to turn on your AC and your AC button does not light up because your when you turn this on your AC button is supposed to light up and the motor is supposed to work if the motor does not work this one will not your AC button will not light up and there's other fuses over there on the driver side there's 40 amp fuse and a 10 amp fuse uh, check that also but 
first if you turn it on and you get nothing nothing come on the relay right here need to be replaced mine was all rusted so I hope this helped um, but just make sure you have power to everything else um, I just want to make a quick video of what I find so uh, I hope this will help you guys thanks to Toyota engineer uh, you know thank you they don't make it easy so but luckily I found it I just want to share with you guys and I hope this will help you guys troubleshooting your AC system and make sure your AC uh, you have Freon in there but without the Freon without your car running when you turn your car on when you turn this blow motor switch on the blow motor should come on and this should light up it doesn't have the car does not have to be running this should come on the blow motor should come on when you turn on the switch and the light should light up if then does not light up uh, this relay is the one that usually go bad <clears throat> and luckily I found it and I just want to share with you Good luck with your AC system. Have a good night.